This is the eighth video in the 10 part login to Firebase with SwiftUI playlist series. In this video, we'll be completing the sign in with email process. Well, now that we have verified that we can actually create a new user with an email address and password, let's code the sign in process. In sign in with email, you will see that there is a login button that needs some code. The process of logging in is authentication. And in our FB auth namespace, we have the authenticate function that requires an email and password. It has a completion handler like we saw in the creation function in the last video, and the result will either have a success or a failure. If it fails, we want to know why, so we generate an error. We can check on this error and create a new one of our own type, email auth error that is more descriptive. We have that defined in the FB auth error file. Using the technique that I mentioned in the last video, we can generate our own localized error and use that in our UI as we did with the creation error. So back in the sign in with email view, since I want to deal with the errors, let's first create two state variables with our sign in with email view so that we can capture the error and present alert to the user if the authentication fails. Show alert will be a Boolean set to false. And this time, auth error is going to be an optional email auth error in enum. We can go back to our button action now and access the authenticate function from the FB auth namespace, passing in the email and password. And we'll deal with the result in the closure. When we switch on the result, if failure, we can assign it to our auth error and set show alert to true. If a success, we can either ignore or print signed in. Now that we have a show alert to be true, we need an alert to show and we can attach that to our vStack. The title will be text login error. The message itself will be our auth error localized description or an unknown error since it's optional. The button will be the default text OK, but this time I want to perform an action when the button is tapped. And since our error is an auth error, we know that it can be one of a different number of cases. I'm just going to respond whether the error is an invalid password and clear the password field. Otherwise, for all other errors, I'll clear both fields. With that all in place, let's test it out. Let's first try to log in with that user that we created, but issue a bad password. Great, a nice error comes back and is presented in our alert. Upon tapping OK, the password field clears. Let's log in using the correct password. Success, I'm taken to the home screen and my name shows up. I'll log out now and try to sign in as an unknown user. Another great alert and tapping on OK, both fields clear. So far, so good. Only two more videos to go. Next up is resetting the password. Videos for this series are being posted as they're created, so be sure to subscribe to my channel and tap the bell to be notified when new ones are posted, not only for this playlist, but for all of my SwiftUI videos.